It's Christmas Eve. Are the stockings at your house hung by the chimney with care? Are the presents all wrapped and ready to go along with the turkey or ham and the pies or whatever your family likes to eat for Christmas? Hello, I'm Father James Kubicki of the Apostleship of Prayer. Christmas Eve speaks to the child in all of us, and perhaps you're filled with expectations of Christmas presents about to be given and received. Do you know what Pope Benedict's three Christmas wishes are? Here's what he said a few weeks back. My first wish is that our gaze, that of our minds and our hearts, not rest only on the horizon of this world, on its material things, but that in some way, like this tree that tends upward, may be directed toward God. My second wish is that we recall that we also need a light to illumine the path of our lives and to give us hope especially in this time in which we feel so greatly the weight of difficulties, of problems, of suffering, and it seems that we are enshrouded in a veil of darkness. My final wish is that each of us contribute something of that light to the spheres in which we live, our families, our jobs, our neighborhoods, towns, and cities. Given all the things that one could wish for for Christmas, I think Pope Benedict's three wishes are things that we can certainly join him in wishing and praying for as well. Tonight and tomorrow as we look at our Christmas trees, let's allow the gaze of our minds and hearts to be lifted up to God. Let's see the lights before us and commit ourselves to being a light for one another during these holidays when so many people feel sad and lonely. Blessed and Merry Christmas.